Most of the people eat rice as a staple food. Rice is good for the body, which can give us energy, but health-wise, it is not the best for the human health. When we eat too much of short grain white rice, the sticky varieties, which have a higher glycemic index, that tend to spike the sugar level in the body. I have seen most of the people who are diabetic, used to give up eating, rice or eat less. Here I am sharing some ideas, how to select the best rice for a healthy life. There are varieties of rice, from white rice, brown rice, black rice, to red rice. Color means nutrients, color means antioxidants, color means fiber. Red rice is a special variety of rice, that's packed with antioxidants. I have noticed people, who have switched from white to brown or red rice, has shown a lowered risk of diabetes, cardiovascular diseases, cholesterol, and lowered blood pressure level as well. It is said that red rice can even provide protection against inflammation, and cancer. Black rice is gluten-free, gut-friendly, a natural cleanser, and heart-savvy. The bran hull of black rice, which is the outermost layer of the rice grain, contains one of the highest levels of the antioxidant anthocyanin, found in any known food. Black rice is lower in calories, but higher in protein content, as compared to brown, red, or white rice. Its antioxidant content is almost six times higher than other varieties of rice. Please note that all varieties of white rice are not unhealthy. The white long grain basmati rice is low in glycemic load and is nearly equivalent to brown rice in these terms. It is digested slowly thus keeping the blood sugar levels. It contains high amount of vitamin B, copper, and magnesium, which help in controlling blood sugar levels. These combined with antioxidants, and anti-carcinogenic properties, found in its brain, and germ make basmati rice a wise choice, though it is much costlier than the normal white rice. For a disease-free, and healthy body it is very necessary to select your staple food wisely, for the well-being of your family members. The price of brown rice, black rice, and red rice is much costlier than the white rice, because brown, black and red rice is not cultivated all over the world, and is also not easily available in the market. If these dark colored rice are cultivated all over the world, by the farmers then the price will be much cheaper, like the normal white rice, which are much healthier, and tastier to eat, than the normal white rice. There is also another ancient method, of eating normal white rice, which is much healthier for the human body, and the normal cheap white rice can be as 80% nutritionally, as of brown rice. The white rice along with the husk, is partially boiled, and also known as converted rice, or pre-boiled rice. Parboiling the white rice with the husk, drives nutrients, especially thiamine, from the bran to the endosperm, hence parboiled white rice is 80% nutritionally, similar to brown rice. This method was practiced in many parts of the world, during early periods, but at present people are giving up this good practice due to time consuming, and due to this good practice ancient humans were much healthier, than these present generation humans. I could not share a video of the process of pre-boiled rice, as this practice has been stopped in my village also. It is also said that, 
Eating pre-boiled rice as staple food does not cause diabetes, and is a preferred staple food, for diabetic people.